Well, good evening to you and uh, welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid and the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why wouldn't they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town and uh, the buses have been packed. Double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of away supporters here too and uh, all of it adds up to make a terrific a crackling atmosphere the match i think will be quite a spectacle truly this really is a quite wonderful stadium located here at the foot of the alps we stand for the national anthem of france Well, that was impressive. Match that. Well, this is the perfect game for all parties, not least the neutrals who've just come to enjoy it. Yes, Peter, it's a shame it's only a friendly, but then again, that may help us see a more expressive attacking contest. And I'd be prepared to settle for a, a clash of, of lesser intensity in favour of, of lots of flair, skill and plenty of tricks and a few goals. I suspect I've probably overstretched my, my level of greed here. There's the whistle, and here we go. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, Kylian Mbappe. There's nothing more frightening for a defender when he's running at you at full speed. He gets into his stride so quickly and seems to just glide across the turf. But when the goal's in front of him, he's also got that cool head that's required to, to pick a spot and finish everything off. Yeah, hard to see past him. He'll be looking to put on a show, I'm certain of that. Now surely! Mbappe! Oh, what a wonderful stop! The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Pogba goes short, Benzema, a oh, well played, he's taken that really cleanly. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Well, you could see he was eager to get a shot away, but there was too much flesh and bone in his path. Griezmann has a hit! Goal! France! And France are in front! A pretty simple finish in the end. What do you think, Jim? Yeah, good defence is built on positioning, communication, and you've got to have a desire to attack the ball, but they were found really wanting then on all three aspects. Nobody took charge.
So a breakthrough already. Azar. And here's Lukaku. Pavar tries to get it forward quickly. Gets away from his opponent. And the shot! Good movement there, but not the best of finishes. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. And it's Lukaku. De Bruyne. Kimpembe plays it out to the wing, dashing forward at pace. Can he deliver? He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. Tielemans switches it towards the other side. That's art. That's Carrasco. Carrasco gets it into the middle. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Pogba. Pavar. Rafael Varane. Belgium are still behind as we reach out for half time. And here's Griezmann. Oh, great. It's Benzema. Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Loose ball, who's going to get that? And it's played forward. Now it's Griezmann. Benzema gets it out to the wing. Pavar gets flagged offside. Hoist it forward. And back A. And the whistle goes for half time. Well, there we are. Off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, they definitely won't be happy with that half. They seem to lack a bit of desire, especially going forward. It wouldn't surprise me to see a change or two. Here we go again, then. Belgium need to get the balance right to sort this out. Ambition must be complemented by just the right amount of caution. And I think the more experienced players can oversee that. Hernandez. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. The crowd appreciates good football all round. Real chance! The Tongan drives it forward. Belgium couldn't do a whole lot with it there. They could do with more sharpness in their passing. Mbappe. So who's he picking out? Plays it back. That's a good ball to... He's gone for it! It's there! Two up! 
now, and they are cruising. Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. France take a two-goal lead and things should be comfortable from here on in. Well, at 1-0 this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. Incoming cross. Oh, and he's asking too much with that. Now it's Benzema. Rabio. And here's Griezmann. He'll have a go. Oh, a very decent attempt. France will think that now's the time to shut up shop. Just ensure you see this out without any more incident. France, on the other hand, are left with no choice but to risk everything and to go for it. Played into the mid. Header! Defence has got rid of that. Hazard hits one! This could fall anywhere. Hernandez. Balls out on the left now. He's left his man. He's still going. Where to next? Whipped in. Keeper sees it all the way. Tielemans. This game seems as if it's going to go beyond a rescue point, uh, so they need a goal and fast just to raise spirits and at least give their fans something to cheer. Mbappe! He's done very well to get to that. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. Final checks on the touchline, a change about to occur. Yeah, it's about time I think we saw some activity from the bench, but it's it's debatable as to what level of impact can be made from here. It's it's pretty late. Mbappe hits one! And time is up. Well, it's ended in defeat and frustration. They just didn't get the breaks. No reward for a very genuine effort. It is a hard one to take this. So what do you take away from it all, Jim? Belgium lost their way after falling behind early. Their concentration was weakened and their character. And that's cause for address. And with that, it's time for me to thank Jim Beglin and to wish you a very good evening.